Hey guys, season review time for the Ireland cricket team. Um, we'll go over some of the results of the rest of the Afghanistan tour. Where um, we were um, pretty much dominated a wee bit. We won the test matches, which is historic. Um, we won the first one day international by 200, uh, tw 25 runs. 25 runs. Um, Adair top scoring with 48 of 41, 8 balls, 1, 6. Vital partnership. Um, he got uh, Doany 42, 40 for Tector, a lot of starts in that innings, but um, credit to our Afghanistan bowl. 2 for 29 for Rashid Khan, 3 for 49 for Zia, 2 for 61 for Mujib or Rahman. Bowled them out for 229, Omar Zai, um, 64 of 65. Looked like he was going to take the game away from us with Rashid Khan, but we fought back. Delany, uh, 3 for 39, 2 for 40 for Camper, 3 for 30 at the top for um, a little. So good start to the one day errors. Got through to two... No, Hound, that is incorrect. We'll go to the second game. 272 for eight, uh, we got through to, um, with Camper bringing up his fifth one day international 100. 103 of 106. 13 fours, three sixes. Doany was a good support, 56 of 69. And we got through to competitive total. Three for Fazia and uh, Khan. And yeah, just a decent enough score, but they got there quite comfortably, Afghanistan. They've added aggressively. Hassan, 136 of 109. 13 fours, four sixes. The momentum would keep continuing with Shahadala. 30 out 27. The strike rates are just good. A shark. Keep the momentum going. Uh, one wicket apiece for Little Manly Adair and Ball. Into the third game now. We got to through to 220 for 9. Curtis Camper again. 74 of 108. 8 fours, 3 sixes. Donny 40 off 61. Ball 33. But yeah, the top order failed again. And it, we're 40 for 5. 98 for 6. We, we continued to fight the whole way through. Practically batted their 50 overs. But yeah, tidy performances from Zia. 3 for 34. 246 for Mahmood. 257 for Mahmood Jibar Rahman. And 1 for 27 for Rashid Khan. But the chase was pretty comfortable again. Really good from Hassan and Gurbaz at the top. Uh, just getting the odd boundary here and there and worked it around quite nicely. Tried a few different options and didn't really be too successful there. One day, uh, one day as we're completed. 2-1 to Afghanistan there. Um, but in the 20 overs, we're pretty close for the games 136 all out um with a deer 30 and ball 26 and sterling 29 um, we scrambled to that score after being in a very dire position calm for three for 46 four for 34 for mujib one for 14 for mahmoud one for 12 omazai if we had a couple more overs we may have been able to pressurize them a little bit uh but yeah good performance from mark Adair, two for 27 one for 27 for ball mansfield on debut we gave him a bit of a run um just to see how he would go yeah, the second one was a bit close. 181 for 8 um, with Omar Zai, 79 of 36. Game-changing innings, 7 fours, 3 sixes, and Hardy, 39 of 21. They were the impact. Um, Hassan was accumulating nicely at the top four. He was dismissed by Ball. Ball, 2 for 48. 2 for 28 for Camper. 2 for 25 for Adair, and 2 for 14 for Little. Got through to 172 for 5 with Camper. Continuing on a good um, series against Afghanistan. 61 off 36, 8 fours, 2 sixes. 57 off 44 for Tecto, 5 fours, 3 sixes. And Sterling, 33 off 22. But we just didn't quite do enough to get the victory there. So, um, obviously, you guys have seen a little bit of each series. We didn't have a very good year, I don't think. Very disappointing um, with the 20 over campaign not qualifying. Um is something that we have to rectify test matches will go over the, the um go over the current year for the team and you see tector topping the charts 463 runs at 57.88 he has come on leaps and bounds in the test game and um Doheny, um top keeper for us now so good job camper was decent enough with the bat Burton still developing 260 runs at 32.5. Tector um, proving that he can probably foot at the level. Um, with Commons, them two are probably the opening pair as Sterling is probably getting on a fair bit in age now and is sort of on the decline. Hitchcock got a few opportunities, still hasn't really taken to the next level yet. But yeah, competitive in the test series um, throughout and a historic win against um, Afghanistan really cements these guys um here but yeah the four main wicket takers little adir bell and manly camphor and delaney really would love them to take a few more wickets but test matches a big pass mark this year like afghanistan getting two test wins uh, over there is brilliant stuff one day internationals current year saw the curtis camphor topping um the batting averages but not what we want um Doheny, 
um, again, um, in the top sort of echelon of players with Curtis Camper. Two two really good standouts. Um, Camper had a good series against Afghanistan. Obviously, Sterling numbers are a bit down. 254 runs at 28.22. Probably still just good enough to keep his spot. Tector, 250 runs at 27.78. Disappointing year for him. But as you can see, just a wee bit too many failures here in terms of people not averaging high enough for us to compete. The wicket taking um, saw a little topping. Eight wickets at 41.12. Eight wickets for Manly at 48.75. You'd have to say, like, Delaney, six wickets at 27.83, pick of the bowl. It's just everyone getting a bit of experience and not quite doing enough um, to get us uh, results. Uh, the, the 20 over year um, was pretty disappointing, to tell you the truth. But um, Curtis Camper, 158 at 39.5. Again, I've done that wrong. There we go. Curtis Camper, then Paul Sterling. Delaney was good. Um, four wickets, an average of five. Delaney. Ball um, is on the scene. Um, pretty much known for his bowling at the moment. 12 wickets at 20.42. Markadier was solid. Um, with seven wickets at 23.57 there. Brian, four wickets at 19.25. But yeah, didn't, a, a year where we could have moved up a wee bit on the tables. But yeah, the broad rankings now see we are one point behind Zimbabwe. Three behind there in the one day and tied with them on the T20 stuff. Next year's an interesting year because obviously we won't be playing the one day World Cup. We didn't qualify. New window for that. New opportunities. Um, we'll play something in Series 1 for next season. Smash the like button, share with a friend, and we'll see you next time.